Uh, hey, what's up guys? Captain Zach here. Well, I am super psyched to be out here on the water finally. So Mary and I are out here. It is April 1st, so we're just getting the season kicked off. We just put the boat in yesterday. Just an awesome sunny day. So it's in the 40s, really bright sun outside. Just an awesome spring day. Just doing an opportunistic uh, back trolling session here for Halley. So this time, is, this time of the year, it's often a little bit slow for the halibut fishing, but uh, you can't win if you don't play. So we're gonna drop a few jigs. It's kind of a mid outgoing tide right now. So it's not, not the most favorable, but we're in a pretty awesome spot. So I'd give us a good chance of maybe hooking up with one. Oh, you on? Oh, sweet fish. Oh, I'm on now. Nice! Oh, double! <laughs> An April 1st double! Nice! Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh, you're off? <laughs> oh, let's see what I got here. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> I think this is a Halley. I hope it is. Not a monster, but certainly some good thumps there. Help, you got it. Boom! <laughs> Welcome aboard the first Halley of 2023. Awesome. Oh, I think we're gonna let him swim, but he just crushed that little seven ouncer with a grub. Nice fish. Oh, we are on the board for 2023. Almost started with a double there. We had a double for about halfway up. Mary's got off, but uh, we were able to get the first one of the season on board. How cool. Oh, I got it all loaded up with a grub, piece of herring, and some squid. That ought to get him. Are you going up and Yeah, we are. We're getting shallower now, but. Yes, hey. Fish on. Awesome. Just classic. Completely stopped the jig. You just lay into it. Oh, this is not a giant, but still great to great to feel that halibut thump. Number two. Another awesome little Halley. I think we're gonna let him swim. Oh, we were actually doing some whale watching right before this and we had some really cool encounters so the more whales will show up as the summer goes on like once more herring arrive in the area then humpbacks will make this their summer home but um but like i said early april usually the whales are pretty sparse but we were lucky enough to find two two humpbacks and got some pretty cool footage mary threw the drone up so uh so check this out Fish on. Oh, you can tell it just totally stopped the jig. Just sitting there with the jig in his mouth. Just cranked him.
Oh. <laughs> Sculpin. <laughs> no wonder. Sometimes they will suck your bait in and just hold it there. Oh well, still fun to catch. Fish on. <laughs> Felt like a sculpin. I was eating some corn nuts. <laughs> but set the hook nonetheless. Maybe it's a pod. It's got medium weight. I mean, still not a big fish, but something down there. Hey, hey. <laughs> this is a chicken nugget. <laughs> oh, look at its back. A little ping pong paddle. <laughs> oh, just a little ping pong paddle, a tiny little halibut, but he was foul hooked, so he felt much bigger. But either way, he was ready to go. Number three. So it absolutely never fails. The second you grab a snack, you almost certainly will get a, uh, a halibut strike. It just, it's the law of fishing. Oh, well, I think we're getting ready to wrap things up. You know, we, we jigged for maybe a little over an hour, maybe like an hour, 10, hour, 15 minutes. And all in all, just a fantastic outcome for this early in the season. You know, a April 1st, any halibut you catch in April is just a, a great fish, definitely to be celebrated. We got we got three hallies and then that one, one sculpin as well. So we're super, super stoked about that and just can't wait to get this 2023 season underway. Hey, just one thing to consider if you're ever uh, halibut fishing in the early season. Conventional wisdom typically suggests that the fish are super deep. So there's a lot of folks who won't fish anything less than 300 feet. So they'll be down in like three, four, even 500 feet this early in the season. Uh, just goes to show you, you know, never be afraid to switch it up. Today we caught all those fish in between 80 and 120. So, so never be afraid to kind of try a little bit of a different play, even if conventional wisdom is going to lead you one way. Sometimes you'll catch fish going the other. You're live. I'm live. Happy April Fool's Day. Didn't catch a thing. Joke's on me. <laughs> 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 That's all I got. Oh, fish on. Nice. We were just cleaning up. Uh, I just took the camera off, getting ready to go, and Mary strikes. <laughs> that is awesome. <laughs> and it's calm enough to uh, to have this fishing stance on the side of the boat. <laughs> Still on there? So far. Nice. How deep were we? Uh, deeper, we drifted out 150. <laughs> Come on, stay on there. Still on? So far, so far. Nice. Oh, hold on tight. <laughs> Just, I can ditch the camera if you need me to oh, I see it. I see step it. in. Look it, look it. Okay. Oh, sweet. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Oh wow, there it is. What a battle. Look at Mary in the last couple of seconds. Probably the nicest one of the day. Great stuff. Okay, we're gonna send him back. That's number four. What a great finish to the day. <laughs>